Hello, my name is Eva Christomaki, and in this video, I will present to you Squirrel Movies, a framework for sequential group recommendations through reinforcement learning. Squirrel is a framework for sequential group recommendations. In other words, unlike many group recommender systems, Squirrel addresses the problem of providing pair recommendations to a group of users for several recommendation rounds instead of just one. Its goal is to provide group recommendations that, as recommendation rounds progress, leave no group member unsatisfied with the recommended items overall, even if they might not be very happy with suggestions of a single round. Square relies on reinforcement learning and consists of three main components, state, actions, and reward. The state describes the current status of the group, the actions are the different group recommendation methods that can be applied, and finally, the reward is the primary goal that the system wants to achieve, the group member satisfaction. The Square model is based on reinforcement learning, at this recommendation round, the system selects an action to perform depending on the current satisfaction of the group members. Satisfaction is based on the relevance of the items included in the group recommendation list. After performing the selected action, that is, after a group recommendation method is applied, a reward is calculated and the group status is updated with new satisfaction scores. Here is a list of six actions that Squirrel uses by default and are explained in more detail in the UI. The rewards refer to the primary goals that the system wants to achieve and include the average function that takes into account the overall satisfaction of the group by averaging the individual satisfaction of all group members, and one more function that, in addition to satisfaction, considers the disagreement between the group members. To give you a better idea of how the system works in practice, let's take a look at the UI for Squirrel Movies. Squirrel Movies is an adaptation of the Squirrel framework that provides sequential group recommendations in the movies domain. A conference attendee creates a new user profile and picks a few movies that they like in order to get an estimate of the individual movie preferences. To avoid the time overhead of the previous step, which may take a few minutes in a live demo environment, we have preloaded user profiles for the conference attendees to pick and then select for which group of friends they want to receive movie recommendations. For the purposes of this video, I'll showcase the results of the group for one. Firstly, the system presents the five movies suggested for the current recommendation round that have the highest relevance scores for the group. If a user would like to learn more about a specific movie, they can simply click on its poster to open a new window displaying additional information on the MovieLens website. The preference prediction scores for these movie recommendations is also shown here. For these recommendations, the average reward method was utilized, which, as mentioned, considers the overall satisfaction of the group by averaging the individual satisfaction ratings of all members. While this approach generally produces better results, it does have a drawback in that it overlooks individual dissatisfaction. To address this, users have the option to switch to the F-score reward function which takes disagreements between users in the group into account and yields different results. Moving on, we can see the movie recommendations for the previous rounds as well as the previous scores. If the user desires, the system can provide additional explanations of how the results were generated. The initial table displays the scores of a movie predicted by a single user recommender system for all group members, and the movie recommendations for the current round were based on these scores. If the user wants to delve deeper, the algorithm selection method for this particular movie is shown along with a brief explanation of how it works. Given below is a line chart for better representation and understanding with the individual scores of each member for the previous rounds. The system also offers the option for users to access more information by clicking the Show More button. This displays additional scores from previous rounds, including group satisfaction, which indicates how well the system balanced individual preferences. Higher score indicates that the recommended movies were suitable for most members. Disagreement shows the extent to which a member is either systematically favored, low disagreement, or ignored, high disagreement. F-score, the harmonic mean of group satisfaction and dissatisfaction, is also displayed. 